Alright, what's up guys? Mick here from East Coast Geeks. Um, I had a question asked to me um, by a guy in my other Kerbal video on how to uh, basically just install plugins and things like that for Kerbal Space Program. So I'll do this real quick, make it really easy. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory on its own, but I'll do it just in case anybody does need to know. Um, we'll go ahead and download your file. I'm just going to reinstall MacJob. I already have it, but I'll do it just to show you guys. Um, you're going to go ahead and just extract it from to your desktop wherever you extract files from. Go ahead and uh, get rid of this and then you'll open up your KSP folder. Minimize that so you can see both sides here. Okay. Go ahead and get that to the main page which lists internals, KSP data, all that good stuff. You open up the folder. Basically you just go to parts. Put those into the parts section there. Um, I already have it, but I'll just go ahead and overwrite all that. Move and replace. Uh, then you go to plugins, and you just drop that file into the plugins folder. And then ships. Now this is where it does get a little tricky. Ships, VAB. Um, as you see, there's two files here. You want to drop the VAB one into the VA. You want to drop this file into the VAB folder. Move and replace, and you have a plugin installed. Like I said, it's not too difficult. Um, this works with any ships, um, anything like that. Now, every now and then there is something like there is a source file you'll have to install, and you sometimes have to make a folder for it. But other than that, it's that simple. And um, I'm not going to make this long video, but that's how you do it. And if you have any more questions, feel free to ask.